opportunities for love. Amen. 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 Go about opportunities for you to love. Where people have uh, mistreated you, it's an opportunity for you to do what? To love. To love. Let, me, let me tell you why. Because love is a fruit, not of the Holy Spirit. Things will be Amen. Love is God. Ne? But love is the fruit of the human spirit. Your spirit. You are the branch, is the vine. Yes. So, the love of God must grow. And in order for it to grow, God is going to provide opportunities of hatred, mistreatment, and opposition for you to respond in love. So people don't hate you. You are just not walking in love. Mm. Mm. You are supposed to respond according to the love of God. So if I, I put a title to this, but I want to say, the love of God constrain us. You have no reason to hate your mother-in-law. Mm -mm. You have no reason to hate your brothers and your sisters. You have absolutely no reason for you to be fighting with people. If you respond in love, you'll be in the same place. Yes. We are all not working in love. In love. Amen. Amen. Let's go to the scripture so the scripture can interpret scripture. First John chapter 4, verse 8. I've been quoting this verse over and over and over. You know, we had a nice time at camping, you know, there's too much power. And we hope that those who remained also had a good time. Hallelujah. Let scripture interpret scripture. Can I have somebody who's going to read for me? You can grab a mic and so on. First John 4, 8. Loveth not, knoweth not God, for God is love. Okay, let's say together, he that loveth not, he that loveth not, knoweth not God, knoweth not God, for God is love. For God is love. Amen. This verse is speaking to every one of us here. And this is an apostle of love, John, who writes. Mm. Amen. Mm. He that loveth not, knoweth not God, for God is is love. In other words, no matter what we know, it doesn't matter. Mm. But if you don't love, you don't know God. Yes. You have information, but you don't know God. For God is love. Is love. First Corinthians 13, 13. The Bible says, now abideth these three. Mm. Faith, hope, hope and, and love. And love. But the greatest is what? It's love. Now, when the Bible says the greatest, it means there is a degree of comparison in the verse. It means there's faith, there's hope, and there's love. There's love. It, it, it does somehow insinuate that hope is greater than, than faith. And love is greater than hope. But in comparison to the two, love is the greatest. Amen. So we know we have faith seminars. I never heard of hope seminars. <laughs> but we do need to have love, love seminars. seminars. Amen. Because at the end of the day, our Christianity is practical. Yeah. It's not some theological concept or theory. Yeah. Our Christianity ought to be practical. And love is the way out. Say amen. Amen. So the greatest of this is love, which means love is greater than hope. Love is greater than faith. Because faith wakened by what? Galatians 5 verse 6. Just write it. I won't quote it. I've already, I'm just paraphrasing from the previous uh, messages. Amen. But now, here is the proof that you are born again. The only proof in the scriptures that you are born again is this. First John chapter 3, verse 18. I said, the scripture, interpret the scripture. In fact, I sense that anointing for it. First John chapter 3, verse 18. The only proof that you are born again. Amen. Hmm. The only proof for divine of the new birth is this. 
Yeah, verse 18. 18, 1, 8. 1 John 3, 1, 8. Now we know, for we know, yeah, yeah. My little children, let us not love in word, neither in tongue, but in deed and in truth. Yeah. And hereby we know that we are of the truth, and shall assure our hearts before him. For if our heart condemn us, God is greater than our heart, and knoweth all things. Beloved, if our heart condemn us not, then have we confidence toward God. And whatsoever we ask, we receive of him, because we keep his commands, and do those things that are pleasing in his sight. All right. Okay, I've, I've given you the wrong verse, but we're still on the same thing. Verse 14, that's what I'm looking for. We know that we have passed from death unto life uh -huh. because we love the brethren. Okay, now we know that we have passed from death to what? Life. To life because we do what? Love we love the brethren. How many of you know that the devil is a spiritual father? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, most people. If if people argue, <laughs> if people argue that we don't have spiritual fathers, the devil is a spiritual father. Anyone that begots or that gives birth to something, the word father means source. The devil sin from the beginning. The Bible calls him the father of what? So he's a spiritual father of what? Of lies. He is a father. So I'm asking Guti. If we can give the term father to Satan, why can't we give it to human beings? Okay, that's just another subject, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, but listen to this verse. Now we know that we have passed from death to life. Now, context. This is not immortality, this. Mm -mm. Okay. Amen? Mm -mm. Now we know that we have passed from death to life, for we love the brethren. What is the concept, context of death in this verse? It is spiritual death. In other words, you have passed from spiritual death into eternal life because you love brethren. There's no love in the world. The only proof that you are passed from spiritual death, being unborn again, to eternal life, which is being born again, is because you love the brethren. So the only proof that you are a child of God is that you love people. Mm. It's not operating in the gifts. Right. It's not doing exploits. In fact, 1 Corinthians chapter 13 mentions seven things that we do. And they profit us nothing if we do not have love. Amen. It mentions speaking in tongues, isn't it? You can speak in tongues and whatever. The Bible says without love you are like a sounding brass and a tickling cymbal. In other words, as the more you say Kira Bashanda, the more you are annoying. Yes. You are yes. making an alarming sound, a disturbing mm. noise without love. So believers have got to go back to the work of love. Hence, I'm going to challenge you with this. Amen. Right. So we know that we have passed from death to life because we love the brethren. Go to verse 15 of the same verse, yeah. Whosoever hated his brother right. is a murderer. Okay. Whoever hated his what? His brother. Is a what? A murderer. If you hate your brother, you are a? Murderer. You are a murderer. Okay. Now let's fulfill the commandment. Romans chapter 13 verse 10. We'll get into it just now. Let's just quote these verses. 13 verse 10. In fact, verse 8. 8 to 10. Romans chapter 13, verse 8. We are all debtors. Amen. So everyone must. Charity never faileth, but whether there be prophecies, they uh, uh, shall uh, fail. Romans. Oh, sorry. Yeah. We're looking for romance. Amen. Okay, 13, verse 8. Uh -huh. But to love one another. Okay. Oh no man. Anything but to do what? Love. Your only debt in this life is what? To love. 
love. But here's the danger about this love, is that they must wrong you in order for you to express it. Yes. They must do something to you for you to exercise it. And because it is a fruit, you must respond in love and it will never to grow to become a matured fruit until you exercise it on a daily basis. Mm. Mm. Because the definition of love is for Lisa the exact thing that the Lord did for us to redeem us. God so loved the world so much that he gave his only begotten son. So the redemption is produced by love. The love of God, the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit. So we are going to have to go back to love and then fully define love. So there are 16 characteristics from the book of 1 Corinthians chapter number 13. If you are not doing them, you can just use 1 Corinthians chapter 13 to determine whether you're walking in love. Before you say people are not walking in love, ask yourself, are you walking in love? And, and you don't have to look further. You have to look at the people that are close to you. Those are the people who are potential candidates to activate love. So, And then, when you respond, you are supposed to respond in love. And guess what we have been doing? We have not been doing that. You know what we have been doing? We have been counting the record of wrongs. Mm -hmm. And First Corinthians chapter 13 says, Love does not count the record of wrongs. Now, now I want to know, says, to do something, I must punish you. Yes. I'm going to paraphrase and over here can if I go with all these verses. Romans chapter 5, verse 5. The Bible says, The love of God has been shared abroad in our hearts by the Holy Ghost. First John chapter 3, verse 14. Now we know that we have passed from death to life because we love the what? The brethren. It means this is an attribute of the Father that is already resident in the believer. But you cannot fulfill it in the flesh. It's either you are walking in the flesh or you are walking in what? In, in, in love. Amen. In fact, let me also define. Now, I'm to love about you walk in the spirit. To walk in the spirit is not to fly in the atmosphere. It's not to see things in the spirit. No. Amen. You are moving in the gifts. You are not walking in the spirit. To walk in love is to walk, to walk in the spirit is to walk in love. Amen. So the spiritual walk is a love walk. So you are wasting your time going to church if you don't love people. Uh, You're wasting your time reading your Bible if you don't love people. You? You're wasting your time trying to be the best that there is if you don't love people. Mm. And let me tell you, it's not easy, it's not difficult for you to see if you don't love. Just look at how you have responded when they hate you. Yeah. Say amen. Amen. Now, your family could be okay right now, but the problem is that we, you are the problem. Your problem. The problem is that your family, all of them are not born again. They are supposed to see the love of God modeled for them. But unfortunately, you are going to have to take up your cross to model it. There is no way that you can have love and never carry a cross. God so loved the world, and then he did what? Gave his only begotten son as a sacrifice. So the day I say I love you, there must be a cross I'm carrying because of you. Yes. He who wants to follow me must pick up his what? Yes. His cross. And this is a cross that carries the message of reconciliation. This is a cross that carries the message of forgiveness. This is a cross that carries the message of not counting the record of wrongs. So you are so stressed and frustrated, full of burdens, because actually the truth is that you don't walk in love. Ah. Winking or winking. Amen. Amen. It's okay to point fingers. But the day I realize that I am the problem, I cannot solve this one. Say amen. 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 Now, we have the love of God, the evidence of the love of God, the love of God shared abroad in our hearts by the Holy Ghost. Now, I'm going to go two verses and I'm going to define love. And after defining love, I want to challenge the church that you are compelled. You are, this is divine compulsion from the Lord. You are compelled to love, to forgive, and not to love the lovable, to love the unlovable. 
the devil is going to send people to hurt you. But God is going to send his love to redeem you. That's the only way. Because there is nothing that can separate us from, from the, the love, love of God. And uh, uh, 1 Corinthians 13 verse 8, it in love never fails. The reason you have been failing, you have been applying your kind of love. Mm -hmm. Your kind of retaliation. But the God kind of love never fails. I don't care where you come from. I don't care what you know. What I know is that if we walk in the love of God, no matter how much we have been beaten by love, by life, love the love of God will never fail, irrespective. Put the love of God in every situation, love wins. It never fails. Amen. Amen. There will be no need for divorce if we love. Mm. Amen. And let me quote these verses, and then you will get where I'm going. Because, yeah, because as I said, it was 2 o'clock. God said, yeah, well, now you're not working. I was like, what? Me? You know what, God? I'm an apostle. <laughs> you know your pride. You <laughs> tell God you're an apostle. <laughs> Somebody say, Amen. 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 <laughs> okay, let's look at these two verses and then I just need to clarify. Second um, Corinthians chapter 5. 2 Corinthians chapter 5, I believe it's verse number 14, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. For the love of Christ constraineth us. Wait, for the love of what? Christ constrains us. Okay, the other rendition of the verse says, the love of God or the love of Christ compels. Amen. There's a divine what? Compulsion. Everything in you want to respond in hatred, but the love of God does what? Compels. And that's the only proof that you are born again. The rest of the other things that you are mentioning are for advancing the kingdom. That's the only proof that you are a child of God. Amen. They will know that you are my disciples when you do what? Love one another. When you love one another. And then the Bible says, this is the new commandment that I give. This is a commandment. God is commanding every one of us here to love. love. And it is only one commandment we need to fulfill it. If we say we are the children of God, the same love of God compels us. The love of God compels you to do what? To love your enemy. To pray for the one who despisefully uses you. Okay, let's go to Matthew 5, 44. You are compelled. Mm. If you are not talking to your sister, you are a murderer. You belong in jail. If there's ma I can't watch, uh, there's always homo issues of mothers in law. Yeah. Amen. If you are not acting in love with your mother, it's your problem. You are the one who is a problem. Because you are a believer, you ought to fix it. You must find a way, because you are compelled by the love of Christ to still love that woman. Who said Christianity is easy, man? Who said Christianity is just reading the verses? Who said Christianity is just attending a first Sunday service? Who said Christianity is praise and worship? Because this we ought to do irrespective of what we have. Listen, God does not need to pay you and to give you prosperity for you to do this. You are commanded. The message is that the message is that and we don't love in word only. Huh? Huh? We do what? We we act it. Yeah. Yeah, Matthew 5 44. And I mean, I'm not, I'm not preaching, I'm just reading the verses that we have not been doing for years. But I say unto you, uh -huh. love your enemies. Okay, love your what? Enemies. Nina, with the Nigerian concept, back to the center. That is nonsense. Christ says, love your what? Your enemies. 
Don't you worry. God will deal with the person who is mistreating you. Yes. Give it to God. Trust God to deal with the person. But never contribute in the downfall of somebody else. I'm sure you are one of them. We are one of them mistreating you and so on. When in order for you to be on the side of God, do what God says. Okay, what are you going to do to your enemy? Love your what? Now, how do we love your enemy? One of the ways of loving your enemy is to give to your enemy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody say amen. Amen. All right, what's the other way? Bless them that curse you. Okay. Ni nantanu kalegi isanish. Mfundi sa understand the good bang and say nibule a feme. Mfundi sa understand the good umtuana se kaya unin kis wembi gancha. Kanta in kis wake embi is a reflect is a reflection yes. of your heart also. Yes. Because when you be self-righteous, until somebody pokes you, your reaction is a revelation that you also have the same problem. You are just acting righteous. Somebody say amen. Amen. My man, I will tell you when the next. You will tell you when the next. It's your fault. The only thing that you need to know is to know that you have the commandment irrespective of who did what to you. Amen. We told him to die like a non-fast wako. Love. What keep his palm? What do you reject? God is not mocked. Don't be deceived. Whatsoever a man sows, that shall he reap. But don't help God to make to help to make people reap with your words. The first thing that you need to help is your mouth. You need to learn to shut up so that God can speak for you. Exodus That's Old Testament speaking. Because if all the wishes were killed, all of them will not be born again by now. They will not have an opportunity to come to the altar. So, Utando, Lutata, Ubumi, Bonko, Kukonim, Saben, Lumen, Zerube, right? But neither again, never come with your little self righteousness. King on, who was? Yes. Amen. Amen. The, 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 the reason I know who to was is because Nyas Uti, Mama Kuruma Nawega, Kukona, Lento, and a pan at work. Mama, I see you doing a pan day with my head, let me understand. He let Puma now I know that when you react, you react in anger. We need to be anger all of us. Again, we're not holy, we're perfect. Where does the anger come from if you are holy? Why do you want to punish so much if you are holy? Again, you want to retaliate. Jesus is a ministry without retaliation. Father, forgive them. For they know not what they do. Peter, what I'm putting there, which is why we say, but I, Perasikola, he who lives by the sword will die with the one with the sword. Every time you retaliate, you are inviting the same persecution or the same curse. Yo. Every time you release a curse on someone, you must also be tasted likewise. I want to turn to Muswe. 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 It is God who's supposed to fight for you. And let me tell you, for a moment you're going to look like a fool. And some of you for years you're going to live, look like a what? A fool. But you are just fulfilling your principle that love suffers long. What do you mean when we have poker, we have a karapa, we keep you home? No, 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 okay. We have limas. No, we have limas, we have limas. And when I want to do, you suffer long. You act as if it's not happening. But you do not have the right to raise your voice and to defend yourself because that is your father's business. You know what? Yeah. Especially when it happens between brother and I made this example. It could be that Uzama is the one who sugele unaleti. Yeah. It's almost Kazama, Sibuna lady, but it's almost Kana lady is sinning against me. Because I am the one who is the father who is supposed to punish my children. Not children punishing children, that's not order. There's a particular rank, even in discipline. Say amen. Amen. The only thing that you can do is to rebuke your what? Your brother. When you see in the Romans, you must rebuke, but 
To discipline, you feel this is the punishment. No, no, no. That is the Father's work. Somebody say amen. Amen. Now, for you to ask us one, you to turn the look at 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 the Will determine whether you have favor. Because don't worry, the love of God loves justice. So justice will be done. But not by your head. That's the problem. Okay. The love of God constrains us. But please read that verse. It compels us to do these things. Matthew 5 44. Love your enemies, first principles. Bless them that curse you. Okay. Bless them that do what? And curse you. Sure. Yeah. Do good to them that hate you. Alright, do good to who? I want to have a fool. When I'm a cool mama, Jesus. People, if people can express the way I'm a fool in a corner, you make a list that day, which has over one man by names of coolness. Actually, you are doing me a favor, I'm getting away from your life. Actually, if you don't grow your own channel, this is a year of separation. You're separated. <laughs> what you're doing is that you are not walking in what? In love. But here's the thing you are not aware that as you are walking away, the faults that are moving to happen. Uh. Ten years down the line, Mount Bona Lomutlo, who you're Kumbulu to Awenza, Boba, it was never resolved. If you have any issue hey. with your brother, we don't do that. We we just want to say, Sir Tandaza, Sir Nigela, Jalo, Goto, and Jalo, and Kodena. And the reason, Kuba no Kukula, no Pagan wait. And that is why, without any holy communion, it's a principle of love, a principle of sacrifice. If a school is a mob, increase your age as it's right when we do it. And hence, some of us are what? As if something that is meant to heal us is hurting us. It's in Amen. Amen. Begad, we will turn that easy to us. I will never hear you say, hey, you dead in Tafuna, Pam, you David, Lord. And can I say something about David? David was not born again. David is not your standard. You? It's not your eye, eh, back to the sender. You turn them some not dangerous players. No, that was around. I understand judgment. Né? When God releases what judgment through a prophetic voice, judging a particular thing, sending judgment on the city, and of course, judgment will begin in the house of the Lord. But please judge this. Why don't you love when? Can you really judge yourself using the love of God as a standard? Okay, what are we supposed to do? Supposed to love our enemies, pray, or bless those who curse us, and do good to them that hate us. And then do what? Pray for them which despitefully use. Did, did, did you see what you pray in Genaru number one? It's because Untanas or Moses and Alama issues of enemies. I was a girl. Much of us are in Nina, Ito, a one in King Abbas or Namsan to pretend. Yeah. And again, we are, we are putting those masks and so we have become storages, Tina, of bad things inside. In technology, I even do it in apart. When there is moment is when you are going to be like, when are we now? And then, we should have a good one. Hey, Amen. Amen. What was so? We put you to one. I'm not even in a trap. We track a serious, a petrol toilo, a serious, where's into, where's in the Mazaban? And as this into, as we see Putala, Marcel will put a lot more of his bumpy. When you were told to cast out all your cares to him, as then the Bible, we are hearers of the word, but we are not doers. And in Abu Nava, they are still carrying the whole garage. That was still. We pet. Zobabonis. And no wonder she's on Bona this year. We'll never see her. Uh. See, which prayer is a number one. Prayer becomes 
the last thing. Because when you stand praying, do what? Forgive. Faith does not work without what? Love. Faith worketh by what? By love. So, Mufunubushi would easily use your zebras and what Zikole is into as the Hindara Umsevens Gamwe. He's grieved at the state of our hearts because our hearts are, are created a stumbling block to ourselves and to other brethren. That's what our hearts have done. And may God deliver us. Amen. But today I want you to know that the love of God compels you. Okay? Read the verse. Yeah, read the verse again. Do good to them that hate you, and pray for them which despisefully use you and persecute you. Amen. Pray for them that despisefully use you and persecute you. And I mean, I'll turn the Bible. Exactly. The Bible managed to persecute you. Ne? You don't need a biblical definition of persecution. Go a picture of the person who's persecuting you. That's enough <laughs> definition. Already, <laughs> So, can we deal with those skeletons? Can we deal with those things and stop what pretending? You cannot walk the next 365 days. Anger, resentment, bitterness, strife within you. Just because you are refusing to walk in love and you think you are the one who's right. I go into every enemy, your tongue, Jamie Pride. You. Oh, my name, Jesus. He pride, he pride the jealous. And the song is now that element of, of pride. Ne? It's now that. Zongjela. It's now, we are not going to move on. We are going to move on. We are going to move on. Do you know my pastor? <laughs> Do you know what was my qualifications? All right. Now, if you want to see the first qualifications, they say, "Man, get that la umje le we na kemi zawa." You want to have a motor na? You ask you to be full in juma le powerful yole. The way powerful na kwa na juma le iso enza you want to have a fire car. Lo muto ngam kulumis umlo muta lufule. Mama zawa. You can't live in resentment as a man. You can't. The love of God compels you. Okay. Verse number four. Charity suffers long. As men call love. Love suffers what? Long. Is patient and is what? Is kind. Love suffers long. That's the whole thing. Which would be irrespective of what the enemy, friends, people brings against you. The God kind of love empowers you to suffer long. Yes, we complain about Yes, we complain We it must prolong, it must take long, until you are in the heart of the other person. Utando Loako must be able to win the battle against your enemies. Your love. So I want you to know, Oguti, there are people who are not going to change this year. They are not going to change next year. They are still going to deal with you negatively. Until you produce the fruit of love. You should look at them as potentials for you to grow in love. Amen. Not as enemies of your soul. Mm. Mm. negatively against I am not aware perhaps or I'm stubborn about my character flow. It could be lying. I keep on lying about you now, it, over and over. I keep on lying. It is my flow. And I'm gonna ask the I'm gonna feel any to repentance about it. And guess what? God gives you a prophecy game, Pone. Ati, Unkurukula, the prophecy, you are going to have new friends, and you go like, Hallelujah. And in the list of your friends, I'm one of them. 
Uthe sikina yakho ukuthi makeza akeza iwani uza nabangani bakhe who are not perfect so our imperfections are going to sort us out but the only thing you need to recognize is who is on trial here you must know that that the one who's on trial who proxy me mean I'm busy lying I'm not on trial I'm dealing with you I'm thinking I'm okay so God has got to use your righteousness to open up my eyes because I'm the one who is actually doing the act and you must suffer Lord Ngoba yes I hate the thing in life uthi kwathile umoya uphezulu ufuna ukale ngisile ukadile bese your enemy is it niya police And let me tell you you cannot always act as a victim because you have also victimized others. Mm. You can't always act like I nake right to mwana mudim. How do mwana mudim continue yeah. being mwana mudim? And no matter what mudim means, you are going to continue to do what to love. So love suffers long. So this person does not change. All the time this person is not changing. They are probably sent by God. Mm. For the next seven years, Mama Zala will be. Mama Zala will be here. Mama Zala. So, you are going to have to suffer long loving Mama Zala because whatever that happens, God will never send a trial on you if he has nothing in you to perfect. There's something in you that only Mama Zala can release. There's something in you that only her can be used to fix it going. Must I concern you look perfect. Mau ka utlabe lo uthi the name of the Lord is a strong tower. Maka ngeni Mama Zala ke aphela ma tower. I feel that I can close this song right now. It is amen as well. Hey yo. The love of God compels you. The love of God never <laughs> fails. The love of God covers a multitude of what of sins. That this person is busy doing it. You don't even have a right to defend yourself. Because if you defend yourself, you are talking the almighty's place. And God says, "Sin just defend dilele. Lo muntu aga phikele la dila nawe. Na u phikele luzwe." In other words, if we don't act in love, we are activating the old principle. and i for an eye yo mama kshaya na nikela na mama kokala you did not decide that people should talk about you something decided and i want you to know people are using that because they don't know that to gossip is a flaw right so they are doing that against you you also have to discern as the person who's been dealt with negatively by people you have to decide to walk in love decide that it is not the problem of the people it is the problem of the spirit there is satan i'm taking you as long as you are blaming people for what happened to you you will always find people and i want to remind we wrestle not against flesh and blood abantu wonga mjelo umuntu uhlale sephansi ukuthi siswambe ekana lento yakho yokuhlebo yesidina yabona wena Yes, Dina, one into yakho yokuhle uqa ngoku uthi solved. Ma uphuma la. Uyotshela abanye abantu ukuthi yazi umfundisi umjwala kanye. Yaba yeka bonke la isentweni. Yazi isukela mina. What about ubani bekahleba ngobani? You will never deal with it that way. The only way you can fight this battle, I just want to say to you, the battle is spiritual. It's not physical. you are defeated even before you start amen so we need to put on the whole armor of god the best plate of what righteousness so if us all run about food these we are balance these we nyake balance amen 
Okay, what does it say? Love suffers not patient and is what? It's kind. Okay, love envious not. Can we all say envy, Envy. Say, say envy. Envy. How many envy? Aksiinto. Oh man, Jehovah, the ultimate. I'm not envious of anything. Somebody say amen. Amen. The envy is simple. I will not care how much you go further than I score. Amen. 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 But you must activate and be low of food and I eat. It's called. Usai trap and in ya. Send me a piece of the man. The revelation I see is Usai trap and in ya. It's mad. Achule. Now, the man of Uchi was on Zulaj. Ah, 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 Zul. Amen. Hey, Mara Babu. Everything in you is in Umela. And I am Kuruma innocent. Look at my car. When you like, you are like first thing like, show wow, like wow, your car, you. Lama Parat, there is no child of God, an unresolved problem in you. Says the following: Kuru kuru maru na chela. Kuru kuru maru unsha, uze unsha ngalo mchete. Ema. Kuru mane end. Nama kam au vuge kse utana. Kuna na uze i situation ena talo oko. Bese inkizo ya ko ikaya ibos. I keep us so in sabula duka ufela. It is the state of the fallen nature in us. I I not get jealous, okay. We will wait for the right person to come. <laughs> so the love of God does not want envy. Now, in order for you to overcome the envy, you need to have opportunities to be envious and still act in love. Then you will be perfected until there's an opportunity for you to be envious. You will never grow in love. So God sends those things. You are, you are not talking, you are what? Acting. Because what you make happen for others, God, God will make, make it happen. For me. You are not fighting a physical sin, Jarosoge, including me. Sin and kin. And uh, the pride, you don't admit to put in the end. Don't admit. Always tell people when I'm right, when I'm fundis, that I'm fundis, ah, 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 ah. Let's go to the simple. Bon, get up and the ball of Washington. Mama, I'm going to go to the ball of I'm not going to get blue. 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 Take my illustration. Every pony here who can get a white t-shirt. Alright? Yeah. And every pony now who can get a white t-shirt. Where are you going to get blue? Uvela ne kriniya. Mama. Yapa na nato ni chwe kanga jam. Yeah. Mama mi le bonga ban ban. The whole church just gonna be just an attitude. Yeah. Wan wafuga yu. Kuna mabut basi wan wafuga. Kati no it was not even something planned. Every pony just decided to be on white and you were the only one on green. Do you know what I have to call the young man? I will tell the next one. 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 I